The 98th playing of the Junior Boys Championship at Torsdale Frankfurt Country Club concluded today, with four hopefuls looking to hoist the historic Peg Burnett Trophy. Mariano Medico faced off against Brock Kovech in the first semifinal match. Medico's two under opening nine and a lost ball on ten for Kovech gave Mariano command of the match on the back nine and a two putt par on the 15th hole gave Medico the victory over Kovech which paved his way to the final match in the afternoon. In the other semifinal match, Kevin Connors Jr. played Evan Thornton for the chance to move on to the afternoon final. Connors went into 16 2 up, but Thornton's up and down for birdie cut the lead to one. A wayward tee shot on 18 by Connors let Thornton extend the match into extra holes. On the first extra hole, it was Connors who had to answer the bell as he rolled in a tough bogey putt to send it to number two. However, another wild tee shot cost Connors as Thornton went on to win the match after Connors conceded the third playoff hole. The finals of the first flight consisted of JT Twomey and Jake Van Arkel. This match also went into extra holes leading to a Van Arkel victory in 19. The match that would decide the championship was a phenomenal display of golf by Evan Thornton of Berkshire Country Club and Mariano Medico of Fox Hill Country Club. Medico once again found himself in a groove on the front nine, going two up through nine holes. Part of that front side was a beautiful chip-in birdie on the seventh hole. After a short miss on nine to have the hole, Thornton hit a great shot with a fairway wood, just short of the green on ten, which he converted into a birdie to win the hole. Both players found tree trouble on the eleventh hole, but Medico was able to steal the hole away from Thornton with a long putt from the front of the green. Short game trouble for Thornton on the 15th hole gave Medico a two-up lead going into 16. I'm just really chipping and putting well. I, I really struggled striking it, so I needed to get up and down, and I did and when I needed to. So, it, yeah, it, it carried me through the tournament without a doubt. I, uh, I tried to stick to my game plan. I was a great attempt at a birdie. It just slipped out on me. Um, I thought I was in good shape, and then we went to 17. And, yeah, they're near on the lip. And the then bunker. I'm on the lip of the bunker. And uh, that was a little difficult. Thornton executed a clutch two putt on 17, which kept the match going, but couldn't overcome Medico's magical shot on the 18th hole. I mean, under the circumstances, it was probably one of the best shots I've hit. It was, I had 158 yards, I think John told me, and um, there was a little, tr little tree limb overhanging about 10, 15 yards from my golf ball, and I was on an uphill slope. So we had to keep it low. So we pulled out a six iron and he said, just aim at the American flag and just hit it a hundred yards and run it up to the green. And I got lucky, it got a couple good bounces, hit it in the back and two putted. Thornton barely missed a 60 footer for birdie on 18, giving Medico a chance at two putts for the win and the prestigious Peg Burnett Trophy. For Gap TV, Tim Peasy.